Hi, I'm Don Knotts. Welcome to the incredible Mr. Limpet. I was told at the time that this was the first time that an extensive uh, animated film had been combined with live action. Hi, I'm Henry Limpet. I'm, I'm, hmm. This was my very first time doing a voiceover for animation. Uh, it was, it was exciting. Come about and stand by for action, you four-eyed flounder. Say, you're talking to me. I've done a good bit of voiceover work since then. Scooby-Doo, a bunch of stuff. I wish, I wish, I wish I were a fish. Cause fishes have a better life than people. I'm not a singer. Yeah, they asked me to sing, I wish I were a fish. Of course, they, they enhanced the sound a great deal. <laughs> so it sounded all right. It was fun. Maybe all along I was meant to be a fish. It was all fun. Uh, all the uh, photography, all the stuff we did live was fun. It was, it was great. It was, uh, it was a different character for me. I had not done anything quite like Mr. Limpet. I, I'm not really a fish. I, 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 I'm a man. I enjoyed the scene where he actually turned into a fish. And the uh, music was, be careful how you wish. And the way they, the way they did that whole scene, I thought was very interesting. Interestingly, when we released Mr. Limpet and Warner Brothers did, in the beginning it was not a hit. I remember <laughs> I went to New York to uh, do PR for the picture, went to a restaurant and the doorman said, hey, Mr. Dodds, welcome back to New York. Hey, I understand you got a lousy movie in town. Anyway, it was re-released. It started to pick up, it started to do better. And as time went on, it just seemed to, to build and build until it, as I understand, it's become a sort of a perennial favorite. <laughs> I hope you enjoy it. Henry Limpet, your name will